Importing large SQL files more than 8 MB gives you this error in the PHPMy admin. Now one way to solve this is to modify the my.ini of the MySQL module from the exam control panel. Click the config button of the MySQL module then click my.ini to open that file. The only thing that we are going to modify is just one variable containing the buffer size which is this one. And then change the value more than 8. I'm gonna set it to 50. You can set it to whatever value that you want for as long as it is more than the size of your SQL file. Save your changes and then restart the MySQL module from your exam control panel to enable the changes that you made. Now, let's try importing the file again in the phpMyAdmin. As you can see, I still get the same error, but no worries, we can use the command prompt from here. Open your command prompt, change your directory to where the bin folder of the MySQL module of your XAMPP is located. Usually, it is located at this path, exam slash mysql slash bin, then hit enter. Let me just show you where it is in the file explorer. We've got the mysql folder from exams root, then the bin, and this is what it looks like inside the bin. By the way, I've placed mysql file inside the bin to shorten the file path to be used as a parameter in dumping. Now in your command prompt, type in mysql space dash u space username space dash p space the name of the database space the import or export symbol This is the export symbol and we will use the import symbol for this tutorial. Space the path of your file. Since I placed my file inside the bin folder, I'm just going to put I'm just going to type in the file name and the file type. Hit enter, then enter the password. Then Wait for a few seconds to minutes, depends on how large your SQL file is, right? And after that, check your database in phpMyAdmin and verify the importing of file. So, let's verify. There you have it. The table is now imported. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Don't forget to leave a comment, like, and subscribe to my channel.